All right, well, it's Wild Wednesday. Shannon with the Dallas Zoo joins us in studio. Tell us about who you brought. This here's La City, or as we call her, Sid. She's an African black footed penguin. Yeah, really cool. How old is, uh, is Sid? She's about to be 10 years old. Okay. Yeah. And, and a lot of penguins like the cold. This one, maybe not so much. No, this one is from off the coast of South Africa. It's technically warmer there most of the time than it is here in Dallas. There's about 18 different types of penguin in the world. Only about five of them live in or migrate to the colder climates. They just get all the really great movie deals, so yeah. we see them more often. <laughs> well, this one uh, is, is pretty cool. I mean, she was running around the studio. Very, very friendly, right? She is very, very social. Yeah, we are very lucky. Not so typical for your average penguin, yeah. but she's kind of a celebrity in our parts. <laughs> No doubt about it. All right, talk about Penguin Days. Tell us about it. Yeah, so Penguin Days is back at the Dallas Zoo all the way through February 29th. Eight dollar admission for anyone who wants to come out and join us. We also have special penguin keeper chats every single day through January, and the opportunity for you to meet a penguin up close. It's brought to us, or it's presented by Highland Capital Management. It's just one of the ways we like to give back to our community for their continued support. Oh, that's awesome. And, and so people that can kind of get up close to, to the penguins, right, and, and hear a lot more about them. Yeah, definitely. Awesome opportunities for everyone to learn about this incredible species and all the work that. That the Dallas Zoo is doing to create a better world for them in their native habitat. All right, very cool. Thank you so much, Shannon. Last time Penguin was here, pooped all over Karen's shoe. <laughs> Today, kind of poop free, Karen. I know. Wow. <laughs> what did I miss out on that? You know what? It's because I'm not there. If I were there, it'd probably be a different story.